Hi everyone, uh, welcome back to the What Am I series of Diagnose Quiz. As you all know in this series of videos, I'll be giving you 5 clues about a disorder or a pathway or an enzyme or a phenomenon or a technique. All that you'll have to do is you'll have to find out the right answer after the second clue is displayed. At this point, if your answer happens to be right, then you get 20 points. If you need 3 clues to give the right answer, then you get 15 points. 4 clues then you get 10 points even if you need all the 5 clues to find out the right answer you still get 5 points. So do not forget to subscribe to this channel and to click the bell icon to receive notifications whenever these videos get uploaded because all these videos are based on facts and concepts which are repeatedly asked in FMG or NEET PG or INICET. So clue number 1 for this question is I am an enzyme. Clue number two is interesting. I am a source of NADPH. If you know all the sources of NADPH, you can try your luck by typing the right answer in the chat box below. And you can give yourself 20 points if your answer happens to be right. Clue number three is I am not a part of HMP shunt. Clue number four, I am a part of citric acid cycle. Clue number five will give you the right answer. Yes, I am the most important anaplerotic reaction. So what do you think is the right answer? The right answer is give yourself 30 seconds timer and type the right answer and the score that you have obtained in the chat box below. And the right answer is malic enzyme. Okay. Reason is there are three sources of NADPH. Number one is HM patient. Number two is isocitrate dehydrogenase cytoplasmic enzyme and malic enzyme. And out of these three enzymes, we know HM patient has to be excluded because of choice C. So you are left back with two choices, isocitrate dehydrogenase and malic enzyme. And out of these two, which is the most important anaplerotic reaction, malic enzyme which converts malate to pyruvate. So this way I have learned few facts and concepts. I hope you find this interesting and useful. And wait until we upload the next video with similar set of clues on an enzyme or a pathway or a disorder. Yeah, thank you.